uh this is a curious case of three things uh which can represent my father's death date that is 27 12 1990 and also my birth date that is 27 4 1973 so 27 12 1990 and 27 4 1973 so these two dates my father's death date and my birth date uh, i am going to prove it with this dashboard of the dermatology department's uh, consultation room where the tokens are displayed and respective rooms are allocated for other tokens so the three things that can help me in uh, decoding my father's death date and my birth date is that the, the dashboard of tokens and the room numbers and the clock which is showing exactly 12 o'clock and the fan with three wings but in you can see it in unison may, meaning that the three becomes is seen as one so three in one so the three wings are seen as one so using the fan the wings as the three in one and the clock that is exactly at 12 o'clock and the token numbers and the room numbers with these three things i'm going to prove my father's death date that is 27 12 that is december 12th 1990 and my birth date that is 27 april that is 4 1973 okay let's go with my father's death date that is 27 12 1990 now to prove the common uh, uh, day that is 27 it is um, simple uh, to prove 27 uh, that is common that is my uh, birthday and my father's death day that is 27 so the day 27 can be proved in this way take the tokens 239 and 436 so when we add up the 239 and 436 it becomes 2 plus 3 to 239 so 2 plus 3 is 5 5 plus 9 is 14 okay we got the first token as 14 the second token is 436 so we 239 becomes 14 now 14 plus 436 so 14 plus 4 is 18 18 plus 3 is 21 and 21 plus 6 is 27 so when we add up 239 token and 436 token we get 27 so in a way it proves my birth day day of only the day of my birth and the day of my father's death day so that is proved that is 27 has been proved okay now my father's death date is 27 12 1990 how do you prove 12 if you see the clock it is exactly showing at 12 o'clock uh, so 12 indicates the month of my father's death date so 27 12 has been proved now how do you prove 1990 now 1990 is nothing but 1 plus 9 is 10 10 plus 9 is 19 and again if you drill down 1 plus 9 if you got 19 that is 1 plus 9 is 10 10 plus 9 is 19 19 plus 0 is 19 itself so in uh, 19 if you add up 1 plus 9 it becomes 10 okay now 10 is nothing but uh, in Roman numerals it is X X when you convert uh, the English alphabet into uh, uh, numerical value it becomes 24 24 is nothing but 2 plus 4 is 6 so keep in mind the number 6 <laughs> So 6, uh, how do you prove this 6 is nothing but you have to take the numbers and the token and the room numbers only. So 2 plus 3 is uh, 5, 5 plus 9 is 14, the room number is 2, so 14 plus 2 is 16, 16 plus 4 is 20 that is this is the token number 436 16 plus 4 is 20 20 plus 3 is 23 23 plus 6 is 23 plus 6 29 29 plus 4 is 33 33 still added up becomes 6 
so we got the six that is when you uh, add up the uh, 1990 we got 10 10 converted to roman numerals becomes x x when given a place value in the alphabetical listing is 24 24 is nothing but 2 plus 4 is 6 so we also got the token numbers with the uh, respective room numbers as 33 so 33 when added up 3 plus 3 becomes 6 so we have proved 27 12 19 90 uh, in the with the help of the uh, the dashboard uh, with the token numbers and the room numbers and the clock but how do you, you know how do we get the thought of going so deep into such you know minute details of just the token numbers and the room numbers that is using the fan the fan indicates that there are three wings in the fan the three wings in the fan indicates the mind body and soul the mind body and soul when it is stationary is separated by each other and it doesn't you know it acts you know independently but if it has to become stronger and united it will become more stronger and more you know focused and more you know powerful in order to bring out the solutions in any kind of situation so any situation you can come out of the solution when there is an unison of three in one of three wings of the fan becoming one when it is aligned and it is you know rotating smoothly so that is the indication of the fan so now coming to my uh, this one my date of birth that is 27 4 1973 so 27 you i told you we get it by the token numbers 239 and 436 239 is nothing but 14 14 plus the token number 436 is 14 plus 4 is 18 18 plus 3 is 21 21 plus 6 is 27 so we got 27 4 is nothing but the room if you see in the red you can see the room indicating that 4 so we get 27 4 now how do you prove 1973 the year 1973 is nothing but 1 plus 9 is 10 10 plus 7 is uh, 17 17 plus 3 is 20 so 20 when you see in the clock in the 24 hours clock 20 is nothing but 8 o'clock so 8 when you take out the 8 so and when you add up the the token numbers and the room numbers so 4 plus 3 is 7 7 plus 6 is uh, 13 and the room number is 4 13 plus 4 is 17 17 when you add up 1 plus 7 it becomes 8 so it matches with the year 1973 so we have proved the my father's death date 27 12 1990 and my birthday that is 27 4 1973 with the help of the dashboard of the tokens and the room numbers and the clock which is at the correct exactly 12 o'clock and with the help of you know the three in one when the mind body and soul becomes one it becomes you know it brings out the solution even in uh, any uh, situation and you can go to any level of you know deeper thinking and bring out solutions from those numbers and give meaningful uh, you know uh, usage to those numbers and all those objects uh, you know you know you connections between those objects and giving meaning to those objects and numbers and uh, you know all the other things that are you no know, uh, uh, meaningful in the way so in this way I have proved that my father's death date that is 27 12 1990 and my birthday is 27 4 1973 is connected in this dashboard of tokens and room numbers the clock and the fan so this was taken maybe six months back around maybe in the month of uh, october or something uh, 2023 
and uh, my father's death day is going to approach soon in another 3 days that is today is 24 that is christmas eve so my father's death day is coming on 27 12 uh this year so it's an uh, dedication to my father and through this uh, way of thinking and you know bringing out some meaningful uh, way of thought using uh, numbers and objects and bringing out that and showing that when you focus your mind body and soul when you unite your mind body and soul you can go any deeper into any numbers and bring out bring out solutions and bring out connections through the solutions and give meaningful uh, uh, ways of uh, answers to this uh, you know numbers and objects and uh, uh, connections thank you